welcome to the channel today we are going to find out the factors for 17 right okay what do you mean by factors right n's factor is the number that can divide n without remainder so this is the definition of a, of a factor in math actually factor is a number that can divide another number completely without that is without any remainder so the factors of uh, what do you mean by the factors of 17 the numbers that can divide 17 without remainder are called 17 factors look notice the factors of a number always the word always in imp important always includes one and itself so the factors of 17 will be one according to this sentence and each cell means 17 and a simple way is to find what pairs of number multiply to get 17 so if i multiply 1 times 17 then i'll get 17 so 1 and 17 are the factors of 17 if i divide 17 by 1 then i will get 17 and if i divide 17 by 17 i'll get 1 right so I will write here the lowest factor here and the highest factor here. So now I will try to find out others factor of 17. So after 1 I have to take 2. So what number will come here? So let me divide 17 by 2. So if I divide then I am getting here uh, 1 as a remainder. Since 2 can divide 17 without remainder, so 2 never be the factors of 17 the question is should you stop here okay let me check 2 squared equal to 4 which is less than 17 less than indicates that you have to proceed okay now try for 3 3 times what okay if i divide 17 by 3 look what will happen I'm getting remainder 2 since I'm getting remainder 2 so 3 is not factor of 17 right is not factor of 17 so the question is should you stop here okay let me check 3 squared equal to 9 which is less than 17 less than indicate that you have to uh, you have to continue right okay after 3 I will try for 4 4 times what? Okay, let me check. 17 divided by 4. Remainder will be 1. So 4 is not the factor of 17. The question is should you stop here? Okay, let me check. 4 squared equal to 16. Since it is less than 17, so you have to check, right? Otherwise, you may, you may do wrong so you have to check so seven let me check for five okay so look if i divide 17 by 5 what i am getting two we are getting remainder two so five is not the factor of 17 should we stop here to answer this question okay let me do this five squared equal to 25 which is greater than 17 greater than indicates that you should stop so basically we are getting two factors for 17 the first one is uh, 1 and itself that is 17 right so 17 has two positive factor 117 you know that 17 is, is an integer so you must have negative factors to find negative factors you just need to add minus sign before the positive factor then it will be okay right so i will have a blog post in the description box of this video you can read that blog post so thank you for being this video be well